Hey guys, Commander Matt. I'm gonna go ahead and show you a tad bit of my ROM hack, just one level. My favorite level of the hack. It's not done by any stretch of the imagination. And I'm open for suggestions, but I, I thought it'd be fun. Seems like it's my birthday to do something a little weird. So I decided to release one of my uh, levels from my ROM hack. So that'd be fun. And since this is the first time we opened it, I figured I'd show the entry screen off too. And yes, I had to add a pokey there. Just had to use the pokey. Actually, I'm recording this um, while the United States Canada friendly is at halftime, so that's always fun. This is pretty cool. That that recording this um, this section here took so long to do. I think it took probably about a good half an hour to get through the entire level without messing up. So, Mario's forced to kill himself. Poor guy. They should have known it was a Kaiser trap. The dumbass. Anyways, so let's start here. The level I want to show is the Sky Fortress. This level is a lot of fun. And obviously the Sky Fortress is going to start with the Fortress. So that's always fun. As we can see here, I need to change the scroll uh, location. But um, we got some stuff. We need a P-switch for over there. So we need to go find the P-switch. And that requires us to have a peace switch race so let's do it I take a lot of pride in this level this part's okay it's really the part that comes after this that I'm really proud of just a pretty basic peace switch race it's not that difficult it's fair Just a couple of things here or there to keep the player interested. I need to get up there. There we go. So now we're going down to a couple of little jumps. Golly. Now it's been a while since I played this, so. Alright, so now we're going down and there's a flimp down here that will kill you if you're not paying attention. But of course I hit the I hit the chomp, so that's cool. Anyways, now we're gonna run all the way over here to the left. To the lava thing here. It's got no purpose just to be there. And kill you over there. And now we got the P switch. Let's go ahead and hit the P switch. That was lame. There we go. So now we're going down and we're going in the door. Now, this part is a lot of fun. I like this part a lot. So, we gotta go collect four piece switches. One of them is down here. This is the silver. Which is gonna be the first one we need, actually, so that's good. And now in here. Which these are chomps, so you make sure to get these coins. Is a blue piece switch, which we need as well. So that's good. We got two of the four piece switches already. And now we can go look for some more. Now you can see the end goal is down here, so if you walk here, you're gonna die. So that's what the ch that's what the clouds are for. To allow you get over the um, the goal post and now we got a lot of bullet bills and some chomps this is actually where I put took the screenshot for my uh, front page so if you're wondering where that was from it's from here just lots of bullet bill dodging and then we got two piece switches here we'll go ahead and take the silver one and if you as you can imagine the blue one is in the one right next to it 
for a reason I can't make simple jumps now. That's fantastic. Do a little bullet bill jump here. Ah. Get up there. Perfect. And I was not paying attention and that killed me. Fantastic. Wow. Golly. There we go. Now we're going back up one last time. As you can see, there's a little bit of slowdown. I don't know. This game's been going pretty slow today. That's kind of weird. So, let's go pick up the blue P switch. So, anyways, my birthday went pretty well. Right now, I'm watching. Well, I'm about to re start watching the the uh, Canada friend U.S. Canada women's uh, soccer friendly again. I watched the UC Bearcats kick the crap out of um, North Carolina, so that was fun. Good job, UC. Good game. And uh, went out to dinner and went to classes, so it was overall not that bad of a day. Nothing to complain about. So finally, we had finally got the last P-Switch. And we're going to go have to wait this out, or you can press my password button. Perfect. Now, we have a puzzle. Now, just in case you can't get the puzzle on the first try, there's another piece switch up here. I'll go ahead and grab that real quick. Just to show you what's up there. This can be done in one piece switch if you know what you're doing. But here's the second piece switch, just in case you need to look before you start. So, I'm going to leave this over here. As you can see, we have all kinds of crazy stuff here. Um... We're gonna go ahead and grab this P switch real quick. And now we're gonna go ahead and press this. Now you can see we got all kinds of crazy stuff. So, so now we have to figure out the solution for this puzzle. So if you run into the if you run into it without with just these explanation points as they are now, you're gonna die. As you can better see now. And you're going to fall and die. So, Or you're going to live. Um, that was not supposed to happen. I'll have to fix that. Anyways, the solution that I want you to have. Get this coin. Press the P-switch right here. Come on. There we go. Press it and hit this. Hit this button. Hit that right there and then hit the goal. By doing that, you're going to fall into that little crevice that you just created and you'll be able to beat the level. So that's the solution you're supposed to have. I'm going to have to fix that in my spare time. But um, I guess I'll show you the pair of fish bridge real quick too. Just as a little bonus. This one's got two exits. That's not the re actual exit, so don't worry about that. Um, this this level's kind of fun. All it is is just some spikies and some fish and some paragoombas. It's a lot of fun. It's just very simplistic. Very easy game design. And now it's time to go on the bridge. Which is just fish and charging chucks everywhere. It's actually a lot of fun. I like this level a lot. Except my game is just slowing down like crazy today. Look out, fish! Alright, there we go. So now we go down and make the jump. And now, if you want to be technical, you can try to beat the level, because you can technically run up this, but you're going to die no matter what. So, we're going to go and press this block here. No way up, might as well kill yourself. May I suggest the bottomless pit may be a little bit more fun. Happy falling. 
So, either you can kill yourself like this, which is kind of boring, or you can go down the pit to figure out that it's actually not bottomless, and then get a star. And then you go this way, and beat the level. And there's coins, oh, I would not do that, would I? I'm an asshole. Nope. Nothing wrong. So yeah, that's the levels. Um, everything else is work in progress, so. I'll see you guys around. Um, happy birthday to me. Bye, everybody.